Okay, those things <clears throat> are called foxtails. And I missed them by a couple weeks. They would have looked like uh, asparagus tips uh, a couple weeks ago when they were young. And that's when people are tempted to eat them. Oh, actually, here's one right here. Beautiful, beautiful. See that one right there? Where is it? Right there, yes. Right there. Nice, nice asparagus tip. That's a young one. That's what people would eat. Uh, the problem with those, and they're growing all the way around here on, along the bank of the Fraser River. And uh, that's what they look like. After the uh, leaves and needles sprout out of the asparagus tip, but problem with that, maybe you get away with it a couple times. But if you eat it too much, uh, there's a chemical in it called thiaminase, which cleaves your thiamine, which is an essential vitamin in your body. Uh, B1 and without thiamine you get a disease called beriberi with ending up with heart failure, shortness of breath, ankle edema, uh, edema all over eventually and shortness of breath and then cardiac arrest so you don't want to get beriberi and I would uh, not eat uh, this horsetail, foxtail uh, whatever you want to call it, some kind of tail, fuzzy tail, uh, that looks like asparagus there. Asparagus, probably tastes something like asparagus, so I'm not sure, I've never had it, but uh, a little bit okay, a lot could be fatal. So I would consider this poisonous even though some people do eat it and it's recommended. I see sites on the internet recommending uh, how to make it and how to pick it when it's young like that, like that uh, asparagus looking one. But it's definitely not asparagus and is uh, toxic on prolonged eating. Again, it depletes your thiamine, which is an essential B1 vitamin and uh, could either make you sick or die of a disease called beriberi. Thank you. Uh, again, we're on the Fraser River. And I haven't mentioned this before, but this is a tidal river. So the tide comes in and out. It's kind of even right now, but uh, this uh, bank is very moist and that's what the uh, horsetails or foxtails like and they are thriving here very nice okay I would recommend you stay away from them buy your food in a store where it's probably safe thank you very much Gary Ordog signing out